the transaction now. And soon you are going to get an alert. Oh, sure. Of course. I will let you know once the goods arrive, okay? All right, then. Have a great day. Oh, I apologize. Sorry, you know, to have kept you waiting. Knowing fully really well is your It's hour. okay. It's fine. I'm, I'm okay. <laughs> All right. Here. All this. Take. The other one is for your troubles. Thank you so much. <laughs> wow. All right then. Uh, thank you. Thank you once again. All right. Uh, bye bye. That reminds me. Huh? I've been wanting to ask you a question. Okay. Don't know how it's going to sound to you, but hey, I just thought I should ask since you're passionate about what you do. Um, thank you, but you, you can ask. I don't know if you can become my personal driver. Oh, no, 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 don't give me that look. Not in that sense, believe me. I'm just offering you a job. Okay. See, the thing here is, I have someone coming into the country in a few days' time. Knowing you have the sense of responsibility in you, so I would like you to be the one that will bring her from the airport. That's all. Uh, uh, all right. Uh, okay, fine. You do not need to answer me now. Just go home, relax, and think about it. Okay. Oh, hey, I will appreciate it if you can call me on Tuesday or Friday morning. Okay. Take your time. Okay. Uh, thank you. Have an amazing day. Uh, you too. Bye-bye. Hmm? I can't miss now. Why you rush the guy that's in the workshop since morning? Bro, you're not gonna understand. Today work here, you know, use it. I'm busy printing money there now. Plenty money for your pocket. If I hear. But today shock me, oh. Today, as the work goes today, shock me. This God will really serve, eh? You know, say person coming for drop. Drop? Mm hmm. Yeah. That'll be the first drop way they get now. Oh, drop now, drop now. Mm -mm -mm. This one, this one is different. Remember that woman where I tell you, say, she tell me, make her the drop. Um. Mm. She called me today. Oh. She come tell me, say, she get person where you come, Niger. And I go pick the person from airport. Not lie. I don't know if you lie for you now. You know my guy. I go lie for you. Mm, I better do now. I better do where you come on. What do you charge and where? Um, which one be M again? Eh? The customer won't tell me to go, go mess this deal up. Oh. This kind of business is supposed to be, not the kind of business where you're supposed to pray for every day. You know? Well, which one be M, M, M? I tell him, say, I go think of now. We're waiting there to think. We don't carry this problem. Yeah, we're waiting for your problem. Now, yeah, let me problem. get this taxi. Now, maybe the driver. What's your problem? Ha. Yes, enough. Please, you are smart and brilliant. Eh? 
Something like this shouldn't even pass you by. Do you understand me? You, are, you should know how to make good use of every opportunity that comes your way. Because you don't know what lies ahead of you. No, no, go carry that girl. Which girl? Which girl you talk? Now me tell you say that girl or not the woman. What did it worry you? Mm -hmm. uh, no, see, no. I carry your phone. Make a choice. Carry your phone, call the woman, then I say that I said with you. No, I don't What's in common with this one now? Guy, put that here now. They talk too much. Who they talk too much? We never walk to the No, no. Now me buy this girl. If there's a day that we see you, you don't go. I don't think people are for you to come back. You do that again on the stomach. Eh? Who got here, my friend? Wait, wait, wait. Who said, wait, hold up your legs like this? Who got here? 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 Who got Yes, Amanda, this behavior of yours is totally unacceptable. We had a deal for tomorrow, young lady. Why take me up like this? Come on, you, you know that I love you much more. But Amanda, listen, H hello? Amanda? Hello, Chima Amanda? This young girl will not kill me. Chris, tell me you're calling to let me know that you have accepted to take the job. I, sh I, I sure have, Ma. Good morning. <laughs> morning, dear. Forgive me for being so forward. You had the tennis days. There's a change in plan. Instead of tomorrow's flight as scheduled, she took today's. So tell me, how are you? I'm fine, Ma. And you? How was your night? I'm very well, thank you for asking. I would like you to come by the office. Let's say in an hour. Oh, okay, okay, I, I'll be there. Yeah, okay, fine, we'll discuss the rest over there. All right, see you soon. Man, take it. You have the job. Sealed. But apparently there's been a change of plans. Uh, what is that? She asked me to come to the office. Uh, that's good now. Uh, guy, make sure you collect plenty of money from these people. Oh. They think ah. they're going to give you money. Who they give you money before? You like money too much. Ah. What's wrong with you? You <laughs> money. I don't understand. Uh, yeah, we hustle live not to make money. <laughs> make sure you collect plenty of dollars from them. I'm not coming here now. Come Ego come. man. <laughs> <laughs> Let money, oh. Ah, let's pray they'll give you money. Of course, they'll give you money. Yeah, get me the stock book for shop three and uh, tell Hadiza to get me a list of the new stock that just arrived. Yes, please. Ma. Yes. So who is here to see you? He said his name is Christian. Hmm? Send him in. Okay, ma'am. Alright. Good day, ma'am. Hi, Chris. Uh, please sit. Uh, thank you. <clears throat> Yes, her flight. 
would land in the nest four to five minutes. And I wouldn't want her to be out there waiting for a very long time. So do you think you can be at the airport in the next 30 minutes? Uh, yes, I, I'll manage. All right, in that case, we have to do something about your clothes. I hope you don't mind. Oh, well, no, I, I Am don't mind. Amanda can be a little picky with people. Okay. All right. Yeah, get me the parcel. So, is there anything you would like us to talk about before you start? Yes, um, about the payments. I... All that? Sure. How can I ever forget? <sighs> All right there, eh? for you. I pray that the service you would provide will be of its best, because I might as well hire you to be her driver while she's here. I promise to do my best. Trust you somehow, <laughs> somehow, you know. Yes, thank you very much, I'm here. I'm sure that will fit you perfectly. Um, uh, <laughs> if you don't mind, can you go? You know, try it on. I should. That's the bedroom. You can uh, go fit it there. I should, should. Yes, please. Thank you. My goodness. Wow, I told you, I told you it will fit perfectly. Wow, you should consider a career in modeling. Thank you. Mm, you're Can welcome. I, uh, leave now? Oh, sure. Yes, I will forward um, her picture to you via WhatsApp. Sure. All right? Thank you. All right, take care. Thank you very much. Bye. Shut up. What's going on? Why isn't no one answering their calls? So I think I'm going to surprise them. You know what? The next time you stand me up, you might as well try to be smarter than giving the silly excuse of being stuck in traffic. Like you're the only one in Nigeria. Just shut your trap, please. I'm sorry. Sorry for yourself. What's going on? What's... Oh my god, this is so annoying. Mommy! <laughs> She's here. Mommy, I am back! Come here, you like it? My baby! Mommy, I've missed you so much, Mommy. I missed you more. Mm. Welcome home, sweetheart. You girls! <laughs> girls. I've been calling, I've been calling everyone. Uh -huh. <laughs> so, this is what you all have been up to. Mm hmm. Why you tell me? Why will I tell you? That will run the fun of surprise. Come on! Oh, I don't want to be a fan of surprise. Ah! Yes, I do! Wow! Oh my god, you look so good! Oh, thank you! Thank you so much! Thank you! So nice here! Excuse yeah. me! Oh, sure, Mom! Um, so... Uh, cheers! Oh, cheers, yes, cheers, cheers! Cheers! So I return! Yes. Yes. Wow. Mm, nice. <laughs> <laughs> you have no idea. Oh, wow. All we needed was a boss for Aiden. Hey, Chris, 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 Chris. Come on, come on. 
Come on. What is it? Where are you going? Um, no, I, I can't. I, I have to get back to work. No, you have to stay. It's my daughter's welcome home party. You brought her home. You should stay. I really wish I could, but I have to get back to work. You know, a man has to do what a man has to do. Get back to the hustle. Did she mama to say anything to you? Huh? Come on, Chris, I am not stupid. I was the one on phone with her when she called you daft. I'm sure that must have really hurt badly. But listen, I apologize on her behalf. Oh, I'm sorry. No, uh, Ma, you don't have to apologize. It's not as if I've not been insulted more than that. It's, it's fine. No, it's not fine. No one should get unnecessarily belittled in such manner. Chris, I promise you, she is not really like that. When you get to know her much better, you will realize that she is such a loving, sweet young lady. Yeah, sure. Um, Ma, please, I really wish I could stay, but... Trust me when I say that my decision has nothing to do with your daughter. I just have to go to work. Are you sure? Yes. All right. But I would love you to come around tomorrow morning. I've got another assignment for you. Okay, uh, thank you. I'll see you tomorrow. It's all right then. Bye-bye. Okay. Bye. -bye. Bye. Why you? Why is your face like this? Like, did you fight with anyone? Why would I want to do that? So you see me, I really like to fight. I try as much as I can to avoid it. <sighs> well, you know, it looks like you fought with the devil himself. <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> honestly, that my friend, that would be the right metaphor for her. She's so insensitive. You know, I have never met anyone as rude as her in my life in this line of work, I swear. Mm. Mm. For you to sound this bitter, she must have really been nasty to you. <laughs> nasty is an understatement. Bro, you should have seen the way this girl was talking to me. Like I was some servant. Just talking to me anyhow. Can you imagine? Mm. She really... She really hit you so badly. Mm. I'm telling you. But you know what? Just let this go. Alright? Let it off your chest. It's not as if this is the first time it's happening. It's been <laughs> happening. So, hope oh, say... This will not be well. Ah, hey, for that one, don't worry. Yeah. That woman is too nice. Hi. Like she paid me so well. I just wonder how she has a daughter as insolent as Amanda. It's always like that. <laughs> it's, it's always like that, yes. But you know what you need right now? What? Go freshen up. We'll be going out later. Okay? Ah. Baba, see that waka, we want waka right now. Let me go do that waka. Hey, this is my weekend. I won't uh, go to the house. No worries. Drink five bottles on my head. <laughs> I, you go food the beer, 
So we were looking So who was the guy the other day? What guy? Come on, don't even have done with me. I don't know who you're talking about. I mean the very cute guy. I don't know who you're talking about. She's talking about the hot guy that brought in your pants yesterday. The Uber guy? He's just a random guy my mom sent to pick me up. Uh, I was thinking it's a noble area. Wait a minute. You girls think... Ew! Are you... Are you for real? Hell no! Huh. No, no, he's not my type. And even for an Uber guy, his attitude towards work sucks. <sighs> well, I don't care if he's an Uber guy. What I know is that he's smoking fat. Babe! Did you see his leaves? Hot. Anna, hmm? are you cursed? Are you cursed, honestly? Really? That guy is hot. Mm -hmm. You fancy him? Mm -hmm. Your taste is really poor, then. Ah, did you see the way he walks? God! <laughs> wait, wait, wait. <laughs> I thought you were happy seeing me. You were paying attention to a, a random. I had to oh, see everything. Oh, um, nah. Well, he's good looking, that's all I know. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You too. Yes. <laughs> Hell no, please. Nah, 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 nah. Nah. Ha. Ah. Ew. <laughs> Ew. <laughs> mm. Always on your phone, both of you. Uh -huh. Mm hmm. Mommy? Yes, dear. So. I want to start sending out applications to different organizations to see if I can secure a job. Oh, uh, nice. Really nice, believe me. All right, in that case, I could um, get one or two of my contacts to secure a very good job for you. Very nice, believe me. Mom, in as much as I really appreciate your effort, I really want to handle this aspect of my life myself. I want to see what it means to be an adult and to take responsibility for oneself. Oh, it's all right. In that case, you need um, mobility. And Chris can come in handy. That guy? What about him? <laughs> Never mind. Are you okay? I put this one first. Okay. 
Okay. I thought this one. This is really pretty. <laughs> right? Yes. <laughs> two. Oh, yeah, yeah, I love this. The two. Two, yes. two together. Yes. Okay. Yes. Sorry, are you not going to take that? Take what? He knows not to answer his calls while driving. Or weren't you thought that you're driving school? Excuse me. Yeah, hello. What's up, babe? You did what? Why would you do that? Huh? Hey, 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 hey. Don't, don't, don't yell at me. Don't you dare yell at me. Look, I, I'm at work. I will, I will call you back. Of course I'm at work. Where else will I be? I have to go. Anita! Ad uh, hey, 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 Anita! What, what, what is this? Oh, I'm hey, madam, 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 please. Is here. Please, calm down, calm down. Eh, what is going on? This is your here. Ask her. She's owing me 75,000 euro. 70? I won't even include the outstanding business of 210,000. Now she's here, they do my para para para. Madam, 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 listen, listen, please, just calm down. Hmm. Whatever hey. your problem is, we can solve it and make it. Okay, I know get time to solve anything. I'm careful. It's not only now, 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 now. In fact, no, 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 no. Madam, wait, 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 wait. Eh? All the hey. shouting will not solve this, this, this problem. This is not problem. See, if this you shout, shout, listen to me. If you shout, it will solve this problem. Okay. Just I get money. Give me that. Yes. Give me money. Shut, shut up. Shut your mouth. Can you not yell at me? Can you? Are you? Are you still talking? Can yell at me? Don't do it. Imagine. Put, put the hand you down. See, you see your life. Your hand if you swear with respect, you're not know, even there for your boyfriend. It's always on your boyfriend. Yeah, you 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 get this Get this Get this Get this Get this Give me, give me, give me, give me, give me. I don't want to waste time. Madam. I know what. I know what. Madam, please. Just, just, just calm down. Is that seventy-five thousand? Yes. See, right now, eh, I have, I have fifteen thousand with me. I'll give you this 15,000. I'll come back. I'll I'll I'll, 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 I'll come back. This woman has this. Eh? She has dealt with me because I was thinking that she's a good customer. Uh, don't worry, she's good. She's good. She's she good. Good. She good. She good. She good. No, no. Relax. Okay. Enough, Chris. Enough. Why are you screaming at me as if I'm your house help? What is it, self? Wait in. You know what your problem is? Your inability to admit you're wrong when you're wrong. How can you owe somebody a huge amount of money and still go for more weave on? Hair. Human hair. Oh, please, I don't care whatever you call it. Listen, Chris, I don't know what your problem is, but you're the cause of everything. Me? Yes, let's say for a minute I'm wrong, but you cost everything, you cost it all. How, 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 how am I the cause of this? Yes, it's your fault, because you don't know how to take care of me. I am your woman for Christ's sake, Chris. For every penny I ask for, you have 1,001 questions to ask. And when you decide to give, you give just one quarter of it. Yet you complain? Why are you complaining? Anita, I am trying. Can't you see? I am trying to be the man that you want me to be. No! Stop trying! Just quit trying already! Man up! Just man up! For once in your life! You know what? If you continue like this, I am so going to dump your ass in the gutter. Excuse me. Anita. 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 So is this like a killer? Yeah, 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 yeah. going to sit inside. Anita, you say I'm, I'm not taking care of you. I said I don't want to talk to you. 
Ah, you mess up. You mess up big time. Huh? Why go begin show yourself now? You follow this lady guy Hamata herself. You go begin to show yourself there. I don't feel if I'm there like that now. Now my woman be that. You try and be now your woman. Now your woman now you don't go carry another problem put for your head. Huh? You haven't even finished paying her school fees. Now you don't go collect extra two hundred and something bill on your head again. Nah, eh? You know the reason at all. I the reason. You know the reason, guy. I lose. I the reason. I, I love this girl. You know, you know, you love which which girl. You know, love her. You are just blinded by her. Nah, juju, cover your eyes. You know the fish. Nah, juju. No be juju. Nah, juju, guy. You know what they call juju? I know. Nah, juju did this. Okay, if no be juju, eh? Why will you be spending everything you have on a woman who is not even appreciative? Tell me now. They had a dog and that thing. Kaina Juju, a big time mess up. Big time mess up with this. And Juju, all the fog in here. Your eye go open very soon. Is this a stirring contest? I thought you said you had something to say. It was you, wasn't it? You told your mother what happened at the plaza the other day. Oh, I... please don't act like you don't know what I'm talking about. Fine. Since you know I told her, why are we having this conversation? Because you had no right. I only spoke to her about it. And she paid the bills. She paid everything and that does not settle well with me. Please, I would really appreciate it if you don't meddle in my private life. Excuse you? I am meddling in your private affairs? Yes. Going behind me and talking about my relationship is not healthy. Please, mind your business. Are we clear? What's the matter? It's about Chris. Did he pay off his girlfriend's debt? Hmm. Imagine. Why? Listen, Amanda, I did that because I want to help the young guy. Is anything wrong with that? Yes. Everything. I told you that in confidence, not for you to run and rescue him and become the superwoman. Why would you even do that in the first place? This is Chris we are talking about here. Yes, him, Chris, your driver, your chauffeur, whatever you call him. Why would you extend such courtesy towards him? You already pay him more than he deserves. Amanda. Is there more to this, mom? I mean, is there something you're not telling me? Something like what? Do you like him? No, scratch that. Are you guys an item? Chima Amanda! Uh, 
I'm sorry about last night. I was out of line. Please forgive me. It's alright. I'll see if I can get mad at you for long. It's not possible. Come on, I'm over it now. <sighs> Thank you. You're welcome. And as for Chris, you don't have to deal with him anymore because I've laid him off. Do you need anything? No. It wasn't intentional. I know. Um, you don't owe me any apologies. It's business. You decide to work with who you're comfortable with. It's fine. Come on! Rice, why are you always so thoughtful? I mean, you make it almost impossible for someone to get mad at you. Well, I try not to step on people's toes, that's why. You're nice, believe me. Thank you so much. Chris, have this. Ah! Ma! What am I going to do with this? Ah, it's, it, it, it's fine, it's okay. I can't take this now. No, 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 it's, it, it's fine, it's okay. Why? Are you rejecting this? Ah, it's too much now. Hey! Giving you this? Ah, I, I don't like when people favor so. <sighs> All right, listen. I'm doing this because Juliet wants to do it. What is money? You are my friend. Oh, which person they give your friend this kind of money? Oh, come on, please. No, man, don't worry. It's okay. It's, it's okay. Seriously, mind you, I don't get it. Why would you go to this length? You were the one who wanted this guy out of your way. Now you have it. What then do you want? Now you have it. <laughs> what then is your problem? Yes, I wanted him out of the way, but not because I hated him or anything. I, I just felt odd that my mom would prefer him of all the Uber guys out there. Well, <clears throat> your mom is not into that guy, if that's what you're trying to insinuate. I know. Oh, well, that's by the way. I really just want to apologize to him, you know, for meddling in his relationship. I shouldn't have done that in the first place. And I really don't want it to seem like my mom relieved him of his duties because of me. It's okay. Mm -hmm. And did you get the address? Yes, I did. I'll, I'll forward it to you. Okay. Hello? Yes, it's me. Oh, really? Thank you. This Friday? Sure, sure, sure. Of course I'll be there. Thank you so much. Thank you. Okay. Who was that? I have an interview this Friday at an advertising agency. Really? Yes. Wow, congratulations. Thank you. This is this is great, honestly. That was really fast. Yes. It's just got, honestly. Oh, thank you for you. <laughs> thank you. And what time do we go there? Let go, let go of me! If you see me in this house, you can just know my name is not called Arenta. What? Stop this. Eh? Why are you behaving like a deprived child? Wait, wait, wait. Did you just call me a child? Wait, you open that thing you call out to call me a child. Oh my god, I have suffered. I ask you for money. Oh 
from now you want fifty thousand and the chicken church to some people you refuse, and here you are open this thing to call me a child, Chris. Babe, can you calm down and just bring the voice down? Can we just go inside and talk about this? My, my neighbors can hear you. Now you have neighbors. Now you remember you have neighbors. Suppose you gave me the money that I asked for. Will your neighbor hear me? Will they hear my voice? You know what, Chris? It's not your fault. It's not your fault. I blame myself. Really, I blame myself. I am sorry it's not your fault. It was me who agreed to waste eight months of my life with you in your abject poverty. It's not your fault. Don't be like this. You should understand. <laughs> what, do you, what do you want me to understand? Understand you killed them. No, understand you could not kill you. Instead of you to tell me that you don't have the money. You, know, you, you keep giving me empty promises. Eh? Is that what I will live on? No problem. I am giving you two days. Two days, Chris. If I don't see that money in my account. You see, this time, this time, call relationship. It will be over. Over oh, for good. <laughs> no, don't touch me. Just give me time now. Where are you going? Hi. Two days. 150k. Ah. I don't fit to. Oh. Okay, guy, I'm tired. I am so tired. What is no easy, you? But so they take you down. Constant uh, demands and fights. Me, I don't fit to. Ha! Chris, what in the work you? What thing be your problem, Seth? You be small picking. Chris, open your eyes now. Eh? Open your eyes. Do you need a soothsayer to tell you that this girl does not like you not to talk of love? Hey, hey, hey. Louis, stop there. What did it worry you? I know say you don't like Anita, but make no the question I love for me. That one is real. real it's okay. real. Real, okay. Mm. Which kind of real? Eh? See, man, I tell you something, eh? I know say truth, they hurt. But I have to tell you the truth, you're my friend. In fact, you're my brother. Any woman that loves a man will not turn him to her eight year. In fact, she should be providing where and when necessary. But instead of this girl to be helping you, she's bringing you down. She wants to run you down. And you're here telling me she loves you. Guy, now Juju be this. Uh, if not Juju, make sure you continue the user. I like him. Uh -huh. I love the girl. What do you even see for this girl, body self? Eh, no, no reason I'm like that. What do you see for where this girl did? The only thing why I don't say you tell me say she's a bit doing her. Eh, she did not go well for you understand for bed. Yes. She knows Sabi cook. She knows Sabi anything. That girl not be wife material. You know what's in the talk. You know wife material. Just behave yourself there. Bless her that she did knock. I know they don't be she because you know them. Respect that your mouth. What be she be that? She not get manners. I know they don't be she they knock that and I go from the door. That's why I'm here to apologize for my intrusion. It wasn't in my place. It was never in my place. You're damn right it wasn't. In as much as I'm mad at what you did, I am grateful. I mean, your mother paid a debt I wasn't sure of when I was going to pay. So, yeah, thank you. Okay, so... Does that mean you are no longer mad at me? A bit. But that's about it. I'm sure you've voiced that when you're having a conversation with her, so it's fine. <sighs> that's a huge relief because honestly, I have never been in such a situation before, so I'm a bit relieved now. So is that the only reason why you're here? To apologize? Of course. Why else would I be here? Okay. Well, since... Yeah, um... Can you drive me tomorrow? Drive you? Yes. I have an interview by 9 and I need you to pick me up and drop me off there. So, you know, 
just so that I'm sure we are on the same page. Where? I'll send you the address once I get home. Okay? I'll be there 7.30 sharp. I don't want to wait for you when I get there. Mm -hmm. Don't worry, you wouldn't wait for me. I'll be up and shining before you get there. All right. Yeah, I'll be on my way out. If you say so. You want to see me off? Oh, see you off. Bye. Mm -hmm. Honestly, you look beautiful. Thank you. I. Hi. I was just catching up with the uh, Louis. Yes. Are you done? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. You're done. Good. Yes. Can we go? Yeah, sure. Uh, Chris, it was nice seeing you. Same here. Okay. Bye. 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 Type that look off your face. You see that thing where they think, eh? I don't go make it happen. Really? So you didn't hear me? I didn't know that. I don't go know. Me, EP. Yes, now. Enemy of progress. Now. Ah, you? then you now AEP. Assistant enemy of progress. What could just put me? Shut up. I go spoil him. spoil him now. How will you? How do you expect me to be with eh, 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 Amanda? You go to the jack after. Eh? You, 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 you won't check to the tabek in the community at all. Guy, don't try me over there again. I don't need My can next visit too. I don't need for the love like this. Hey, you know, see this thing. Yeah, I don't want to. Hey, so did you fall finish like this? I don't try to put finish you. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> I'm telling you, she was few seconds from kissing that guy. Mm -mm, I wasn't. You were? Huh. Okay, 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 girls. <laughs> Sweetheart, <laughs> it's not like I'm believing Amanda over you, mm -hmm. but I know you. <laughs> I know you, so I'm sure you did that. Mm -hmm. Okay, yeah. So, what? Listen, you girls know I like cute guys. Huh? Yes, no. Mm -hmm. I mean, I'm a sucker for good looking guys. Mm -hmm. To top it all, the guy is into web designing and all that stuff. So why not? Anna, I yeah. told you so. You see? You see your girl? When can you change? Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I believe there is a, um, should I say a word or a statement that says, if you like someone or rather if you love someone, just walk up to that person and say hi. Oh, <laughs> it is a shock I see. Mm -hmm. I like that. <laughs> Our girl is blushing. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> You're really blushing. Hmm. What is the meaning of this? What is all this? What's with the hold up? Hello, mom. Hello, baby. Are you ready? Mom, please, can you just get a hold of Chris? I've been trying to reach him and his number is not reachable. He's supposed to get here by 7.30 and, and it's, it's past 8 already. You booked Chris? Oh, I thought you said... Mom, 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 please, this is not the time for this. I just need you to get a hold of him. If you can't make it, then you should let me know so I can look for another option. Why are you keeping me here? All right, sugar, don't worry yourself. I'll try. What nonsense. No, I can't. I can't even. Well, Hello, Anna. Anna, please, I need you. I need a ride, please. I just need a ride, please.
Come on, girl. You need to take it easy on yourself. The most important thing is that you went for the interview and you did fantastically well. No. I did not. I was so disoriented. You should have been there. You should have been there to see me start out upon questions. It was so... No, no, that was so embarrassing, please. But you still did well, right? Come on! All we have to do now is to pray for a better result. Come on, she doesn't need any good result on things like this. She wouldn't listen to me. I've told her severally. Allow me make some calls and get you a better job. No, my daughter wouldn't listen. Thank you very much. Honey, please, I, I don't need you to do anything for me. Just let me handle this aspect of my life myself. See, sweetheart, I wouldn't want you sweating over things like this. Okay? Everything from me. Please, is, is Amanda in? Amanda. Thank God you're here. I'm so sorry. I've... We had an agreement. You were supposed to be here by 7:30, but you didn't show up. No, 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 let, let, let's hear it. Let us hear it. Another lame excuse, right? Let me guess. You were stuck in traffic, you, you, you had a flat tire, or you probably had an argument with that your silly girlfriend and you didn't have the dignity to show up, right? No, no, no see, whatever silly excuse you've come here to give, I need you to keep quiet because I will not listen to it, okay? You know what? I don't blame you. I blame myself for trusting you and believing that you will have a little decency in you to keep to your word. You know what? You are so full of trash and I need you out of my compound right now. Get out! Amanda! Amanda! What? Amanda! Amanda! Amanda. Oh. Chris? Uh. What is this? What is wrong? I was, my goodness. I was attacked. You oh. took everything from me. Sorry. Yeah. You need to go to the hospital right away. I will. I, I just came to explain to her why I, I couldn't make it. Please, relax. Your health first. Please, to the hospital. Chima Amanda, you shouldn't have spoken to him in such manner. What is wrong with you? Is that how I raised you? Mommy, please, I am not ready for oh, this. please, do not please me. It wasn't nice. What you did was not right. You shouldn't have spoken to him in such manner. That's what I'm saying. Really? I shouldn't have spoken to him in that manner? Oh, yes. I almost missed an interview. So tell me why I shouldn't be mad. But you saw what happened. You clearly saw his state when he came here. Which shows that something happened to him that made him not to come pick you up. Oh, come on. 
and he had the decency to come explain to you, but yet you would not even give him listening ears. Come on, Chibamanda. Oh, so you are really defending him at this time? I can't believe this. I can see your love for him has suddenly clouded your judgment. I beg your pardon. How many times will I warn you not to use such language? I am not in love with him. There is nothing going on between the young man and I. Because of your hatred for him, I let him off his job. Yet, you went behind me. We employed him. And he failed you. Come on. Relax your mind and suck it up. Go and apologize to that young man. No. That is what you should do. No, mommy. I will never do that. I won't. And then you see, whatever deal I had with him is totally over. It's done. Please. I just feel so angry, Des. You know me. I wouldn't. Come on, babe. That's enough. You already said you feel bad for what you said to her. That should be enough. I'm sure she'll forgive you once you apologize. <sighs> to be frank, I don't know if coming back is a good idea, honestly. Because I haven't even been home up to a month and we've quarreled so much because of this guy. Don't think too much about it anymore, okay? Um, you know what's gonna happen now? Uh, we call her up and... I don't think you should. I will handle it myself. Make sure you do. You know it's not right to go to bed with anger bubbling inside us. You know, right? Yeah, true. Thank you. I feel so relieved now. Okay. I'll just let you get back to work. Sorry for calling at this time. No problem, babe. Is there something you should tell me concerning what we talked about last time? I... I still need more time, Tess. Of course, babe. Do take your time. But just know I won't wait forever. I won't make you wait. Um... When are you coming back? I don't know, babe. There are still a few things I need to get done here. Don't worry. You'll be the first to know when it's time. Alright? I love you, babe. Bye. Bye. That girl, the crazy one. Huh? That girl, the mad, where, 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 where? She the get sick or scoff her head. So she thinks I'm by choice. Huh? Those guys mocked you like this. I get the mad though. You're going to the pen, man. She not even allow me to talk one, one word. Come they insult me front and back, say, eh, I, 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 I go to deal with my woman, that's why I, I don't come pick up. Now, if you deal with your woman, uncle, Hi. if you deal with your woman, what do you consign him now? I sure do. See him now. See, that girl does not have conscience at all. She does not have conscience. Eh? You're supposed to waste your, 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 your time and saliva for, for, for people like that. Eh? She could have called another driver now when she didn't see you. Hi. Yeah, I don't think all this much, I'll tell you. Uh, bro, food, food day for us. Uh, something day, dear. Ah, it's going be something. I cook small rice now. Nah. I don't tie to the chop rice. Sure, so. you don't tie to the chop rice. You go chop rice and so I will take. No, no, no. I want chop. I will go sit down. Go chop rice. Take your drugs first. Let her go. Talk no, about that. I want take chop. Jesus Christ, Karina, I can't believe this is you. Wow. 
This is still me, girlfriend. <laughs> Same old Karina. It's not true. Come <laughs> on. A lot has changed since the last time you came. By the way, what are you doing here? <laughs> Tell me. Well, maybe like the saying, since Mohammed cannot go to the mountain, the mountain will have no choice than to go to Mohammed. That's exactly what I'm doing here. Ah, look at you. Come on, Karina. <laughs> you know it's not like that. Oh. Honestly, it's not. I have been meaning to come see you. But then you know the nature of my business. You know, with new inspirations and uh, designs coming up. Truth, to tell you the gospel truth, I spend half of my days in studio. Knowing the kind of women I deal with. You gotta be creative, spontaneous, with new inventions and additions, you know, to keep it up. I know. I know. And I know all of this. And that's exactly why I'm here. You know everything. <laughs> you are not complaining. <laughs> you know everything. <sighs> she did that? I think she's out of my blood. Always looking for something to talk about. Okay, babes. I need you to tell me something. Is she saying the truth? I mean, in one of those her many insinuations, is she saying the truth? What do you want to know, Karina? Do you want to know if I like the young man? Do you? Well... He is a piece of fine mate. Oh. Believe me, he is handsome and cool. So, so what? Her fears are in order. <sighs> Her fears are not in order. They are misguided and misdirected. Come on, Karina. You know me too well. I mean, I have been bonded before. I have, and you know where that got me. It is only you who knows me better than everyone in this city. And you think with all that, I am willing to expose myself and my daughter to such attraction. Was, Come on. I was going to ask you that. Yes, I was going to ask you that. After all you've been through already, why are you allowing your emotions to come in between your sense of wisdom. Why don't you concentrate on enjoying the little all? The things you've achieved over the years that having this big cream with Mandy, your own daughter. Come on, babes. Well, all those are in her head to tell you the truth. Believe me. Yes, I admit the fact that I have a soft spot for this young man. Come on, that doesn't equal me having canal knowledge of this guy. Believe me, listen, if I have some scratching, I think I know how to go about it. I hope so. I just hope so. But what if she's right? Oh God. What if you really do have this affection for this guy that you're trying so hard to even hide from yourself? Karina, just shut up. <laughs> silly you. Come on. No, you silly girl. Oh, now relax. <laughs> Tell me something. Come in. Yes, uh, please. Come in. Mom, Juliet. Uh, sh should I offer you anything to drink? <sighs> oh, uh, I'm sorry. 
pardon my manners. Please have a seat. Thank you. Wow, nice apartment you have here. Uh, thank you. Um, See, you do not need to get yourself walked up because of me. You don't have to be tensed. I'm good. I do not want anything. Ah, you don't want anything? This is your first time in my house and I have to be a generous host. Ah. All right, next time. Next ah. time? Yes. I'm sure okay. you must be wondering how I got to know this place. It was quite easy. Mm. So how are you? Well, I am, I'm getting better. And uh, it's just... I... You know, you never really told me what happened. So tell me, what happened? I was mocked. They took everything from me. My car, my money, my phone. I, I was unconscious. And when I gained consciousness, I, I didn't know where I was. Ma, please. I hope my mother doesn't think it was intentional. I, I didn't do it on purpose. Oh. Shh. It's all right. You don't need to apologize or feel guilty. Before. I don't know you. Oh, if not, you wouldn't have been so shocked to see me, but you were. Um, yes, she's supposed to be my guy's girlfriend. Uh, sorry, let me rephrase. My guy's cheating of a girlfriend. That's what she is. What is wrong with you, Louis? Can't you just mind your business for once? I said I don't know you. Can't you just guess it? And she knows my name. It crossed your mind, didn't it? Babe, I don't know what all this is about, but... But nothing, young fellow. I don't know if you are deaf or blind that you cannot read and understand the handwriting on the wall. She is a friggin' cheat. A friggin' gold digger and she is cheating on my guy, my best friend, with you. That is it. And... You, do you know that Chris got mugged and almost got killed? And how days? is that supposed to be my business? We are long done. Like, I mean, whatever transpired between both of us has been long cut off. So I don't see how I should consign myself with whatever happens to him. You were done with Chris? Yes, long I time ago. I said I was done with him long time ago. You are shameless. You should have some respect for yourself. Have mercy for yourself. Does it? I'm out of here. Baby, no. baby, come no. on, honey. Come on, don't tell me. You are taking what he said serious. He's a drunk. He oh, doesn't know what he's oh, saying. Come on. First, you told me you didn't know this guy. All of a sudden, his name slips off your mouth. Okay, I can't. Like, how can you explain this? I'm sorry. I can't. Okay, wait, hold on. How about everything you said? They're all lies. I don't They're know where lies. he got all those lies from. Look at it, look. I'm sorry, okay? Baby, no, 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 baby, no, no, please, come this. on. I'm sorry, I can't do it. Please, excuse me. That girl is so shameless. So shameless. She needed to see her pretending like she didn't know me from anywhere. 
a poor guy was <laughs> enjoying her lies. But I think he finally got the message. But Christopher, Chris, I think you do not have to give that girl any more chance. Move on. Because she is not going to change for any reason. Do you hear me? Christopher! Ha! Are you for real? Of all times to switch off on me, it's at this critical time. I heard you. You didn't hear me. Okay, if you did, what did I say last? You said she will never change for anything. Oh. I'm glad you were listening. But, what were you thinking? Because it seemed lost. It's nothing. Don't tell me it's nothing. I know there is something, so say it. This is kind of personal. No reason you should tell me. I'll tell you. I'm listening. Amanda's mother was here earlier. Mm -hmm. Amanda's mother. She yeah. was here. And she nearly kissed me. Are you serious? <laughs> tell me it didn't happen. She kissed you? No, that's not what I said. She was about to kiss me and her phone rang. Okay, okay, fine. Tell me the truth. If her phone didn't ring, as she said, would you have kissed her? <laughs> You're stupid. How are you, my friend? <laughs> Hear me out. I've heard enough, Talia. No more of it, please. Listen, this, this, you can't, you can't obviously hold this forever. Huh? You can seriously hold this over this guy's head forever. He did the best he could by coming here, trying to explain himself. Like, I care about his damn explanations. Listen, we are done. What more could there be? What is this about? What is it about this guy that irritates you so much? Because I refuse to believe it's just about him coming late to pick you up for him. Well, you can believe whatever it is you want to believe. I don't care. All I know is that Chris is so done with this family and that is final. Okay? Girl, cut this guy some slacks. He was robbed. If you want a full explanation of what that means, he lost everything, including his only means of livelihood, his car. That practically means he's starting from the scratch. Mm -hmm. And you, you heard that from who? Mm -hmm. Let me guess. His so-called hot roommate. I can see you all see things clearly with him. Can you just stop being insensitive and do the right thing? This thing is not going to take you anywhere, girl. Keep it down, please. I knew it. I knew it. What? Ah, come on. Bad girl. Ugh. You got it hot for this guy. Oh, please, spare me. I told you I stopped it before anything could happen. Oh, well, let's just say I, I had a phone call. You know. Mm. I see. Oh, please get out. <laughs> See, can I tell you something? Alright, I'm listening. 
Sure. I might be sick. I might be dying gradually. You know, you never can tell. Do you think I should see a doctor? Girl, nothing is wrong with you. You are normal. Nothing is absolutely wrong with you. It's, these things come naturally. Do you think so? Yes, and besides, I think you need it. You need what? With a younger guy? Oh, please. I could pass for that guy's mother. Come on, this is insane. <laughs> I totally disagree with you. You are not insane. And no one is insane here. Okay. This is completely normal. Besides, something like this has happened before. Oh, yes. Yeah. But with an older man, come on. I knew what I was doing then. Because I was desperately in need to give my daughter a better life. And you, you know where that got me? Oh, well, I, 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 I can still remember I was there. It was bad. Really bad. But then, don't you think you need some romantic touch? Get out. Come on, drink up. <laughs> of course I will. Mmm. <laughs> mmm. Wow, it tastes so good. Well, I said I was sorry. What else do you want me to do to make you feel better? My problem with you is not adhering to anything. I just told you we are done. And I said we are not. I am not, I'm not, I'm not the rest of your girlfriends that you've been with that you dump any how you like. Besides, I am not that cheap. You know what? Actually, you're the first girl I have been with since I decided to move on. And trust me, I regret that decision. <laughs> and talking about being cheap. <laughs> Honey, you're cheaper than my mind can ever imagine. How dare you? How dare you talk to me in that manner? You are such an ungrateful bastard. Ungrateful fool, that is what you are. No, 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 you just want to dump me after everything we have been through together. How no, honey? You can't. No, I won't let you do that. I will not make it easy for you. Besides... Okay, let me just calm down. Come on, honey. You know your friend doesn't like me. He doesn't... Hey, 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 shut up. Shut your mouth. Leave Lewis out of this. We've been done before now. We just didn't have the right ground to call it what it is. What do you call an on and off relationship? Huh? Tell me. Okay. Fine. You're done, right? No problem. Have it your way. Okay? Just have it your way. But you and I know that you will come back crawling for me. Get out of Get out of my house. Get out What's up, man? What's the deal with the little girl? She almost screamed on my earbox just now. I broke it off with her. You or what? I did. She. I know what I did. Back together. That's what you've always said. Not this time. I am so done. Mm. Mm -hmm. That's fine, that's fine, but I have to wait a while before I pop my champagne. Because that girl got you wrapped around her fingers. You know that? Well, you know how life is. Sometimes you need a bit of an eye opener for whatever decision you make. Mm, yeah. Coming from you, I bet. Less is taking less toll on you as it usually does. So what's up? Uh, are you going to hit off with 
just sugar of money. No. I don't tell you. See, I wouldn't have that kind of feelings for that woman. Uh -huh. We are never a thing and never will. So, come on, take for your heads. She got on me. This guy. This guy. Okay. Yes, yes. Oh, thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Okay, Monday. That's fine. That's awesome. Awesome. Thank you so much. I really appreciate. Thank you. Oh my god. Oh my god. This is cute. Hello? Hi, Mommy. What has got my daughter grinning from ear to ear? Mm. Any good news? Oh, great news, Mom. Come in, come in, come in, come in, come in, come in. You won't believe what just happened. Tell me. So, I just got a call back from one of the companies. <gasps> You've got a job. I did what? Oh, my God, Green. That's nice. That's amazing. Thank you, mommy. I'm super proud of you. Me too. Ah, well, I've always known you could pull it off. Yes. Uh huh. Look at you, Shakara. <laughs> yes, so. So when are you starting? Yes, um, the rotation starts on Monday, and I resume fully on Wednesday. All right, that's mm -hmm. nice. Believe me. Thank I you. am proud of you. Thank you, mommy. Um, Thank you, mommy. Uh, this calls for a celebration. Of course. So, where are you taking me? Come on, come on, come on. Uh, you should be the one taking me out. Oh, no. You should be the one. The bill should be on you, stingy girl. Mommy. What? I've not even earned my first salary yet. <laughs> <laughs> <I know. laughs> All right. Well, we should, we should pop. Some champagne, which yes, should I get, yes. mommy? Ah. Mm. Hi, mom. Hey, you. Hiya. Come here. Come, 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 come. Mm. Look at you! Yeah. What are you doing here? Uh, are you not supposed to be at work? Yes, I am, but it's lunch break and I'm here for school have lunch. Oh, can't I do that? Why not? Mm -hmm. Come on, of course you can! <laughs> alright, alright, just give me one minute. Let me tidy up my table, okay? Alright. Ladies, please, uh, can I take your order? Chris? Hold on. You work here now? Um, Ma, this is our menu. You can choose from here. When you're done, you let me know. Thank you. believe he now works in a restaurant as a waiter. What is that? I mean, I remembered asking him a few times if I could help getting him a cup, but he refused. He's so proud of himself. I mean, I can't imagine him starting all over again. I'll be in my room. What? Why are you not going back to the office? Um, I don't feel too well. Then you should go see a doctor. Mommy, don't worry yourself. I'll be fine. Oh dear.
Hello, Ma. Hi, girls. Good day, Ma. Good day. Wow. Yeah. See them. <laughs> How about your parents? They're great. Um, is Mandy at home? Yes. We're just around the corner. We decided to swing in, come drag her out. Hmm. That's nice. Thoughtful of you girls. Mm -hmm. Yes, she has been in her room for days. Honestly. Um, I wonder what her office people will be saying by now. Okay. Great. We'll just see her, mom. All right. By the way, you guys are looking so pretty. Thank you, Mandy. <laughs> So heartless. How could I do this to someone? I didn't even give him a chance to explain himself. Until on top of it, I so insulted him. I feel so terrible. Um, come on, babe. Don't be so hard on yourself. Yeah, you made a mistake by not listening to him, but but Tanya, Tanya did want me to. What kind of a person am I? A good one. One who is feeling so down right now. Because of one mistake. Which is not paying attention. But baby's okay. Don't beat yourself about it. I'm pretty sure if you explain things to him, he will understand. No. He wouldn't want to see me. And truthfully, if this situation is reversed, I wouldn't want to see me either. See, Amanda. You're not the reason for his present predicament. He's doing whatever he's doing now because he needs to survive. Like they say, an idle man is the devil's workshop. He should walk. I should go see him. Should no, 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 babe. I don't think that's a wise idea. You already told him you're done with your servants. Just leave it at that. You're feeling this way because you're human and it's okay, it's understandable. But you going over there, I don't want any other raves. Please. I know I made okay. some mistakes in the past. No, 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 you're joking, right? Is this what I ordered? I'm sorry, Ma. You, you said you wanted um, chips with egg sauce. I, uh... Are you mad? No, no, are you stupid? Mm. You are like a bold one. Is this how this place is run? You know, I'm sorry, is this how this place is run? Why can't you serve your customers rightly? Ben, calm down. I mean, you already apologized. There was no need for you to slap him. I'm sorry, but he deserves it. That is what he deserves for not doing his job properly. Or you are probably doing all of this to suit your hurting ego. Let me guess. You don't want pretty boy here to know what a liar you are? <coughs> and who is talking? The one that will change the color of your face if you don't apologize to him right now. <coughs> Wait, wait. Uh, I sure apologize to him. Yes. For what? If there is anyone to apologize here, it should be him. For not doing his job properly. Really? Yes. I saw everything that happened. You are the one to apologize to him. He insulted me. No, he did not. You should apologize to him, you know. Please calm down. Just make it calm. Um. What? Did you have anything to say? Uh, uh, Please, uh, sir. Apologize to her. No, why should he? She insulted and slapped him, so she should be the one apologizing him. He is an employee who deserves to respect everybody that walks into this place. Madam, um, I don't know what this whole thing is all about, but I want to apologize for whatever he did. I know he must have done something wrong. I apologize on his behalf. I am sorry. I am not accepting your apology. He should be the one to apologize. 
Chris, sir. I apologize. Uh, I am so sorry, ma. Sorry for yourself, for your miserable self. Did it, did it not? Thank you, ma. Excuse me. Oh, I'm fine, it's okay, I'm fine. I don't want this. Great! What is with you? Huh? Who the hell are you to interfere with my work? I'm sorry for the intrusion, but that girl... What is it with you? Do you know how much trouble you've gotten me into right there? I'm sorry, but I was only trying to help. How many times do I have to tell you that I don't need your help? You need a dictionary to understand that I don't need your help? I have been doing this for months now, and I know my duties. If you're done eating your food, why don't you just leave? I was going to, but I needed to talk to How you. How many times do I have to tell you that I don't need to talk to you? I don't want to talk to you! Chris, I... When I wanted to talk to Miss All High and Mighty, what did you do? You insulted me and shut me out! You are no different from her. How can you compare her with me? Why wouldn't I? Tell me, why shouldn't I compare her with you? Now you listen to me. Why did you have to show up? To mess up this little thing I am doing to sustain myself. Please just leave. I beg you. I don't want to see or talk to you. Just leave me alone. Jeez. I honestly don't get it. I mean, why wouldn't he talk to me? Yes, I admit I was wrong, but how was I supposed to know that he, he was telling the truth? Look, don't even give me the, you brought this upon yourself look, okay? I was angry. Um, Mandy, no one is blaming you here. You've been doing that to yourself long enough, so it's fine. I really need him to forgive me, honestly. I mean, can't he spare me at least 30 seconds of his time without the I don't want to see you look? I really don't like myself right now. So what are you going to do about this? Keep repeating the same thing all over again. You know, you really need to sound like a broken record. Unless you have feelings for that guy. Because uh, I don't understand why you are so perturbed more than you were a few months ago. Yes. You need to chill, Mandy. I'm chilling already. I just... Mandy. Fine. What's going on now? I'm tired, I'm tired. You've been saying that for over 15 minutes and I'm tired. Hi. Huh? God. Hello? Yes, now for front of that, that's the way they do you now. For front of there, I think you just come there. And when you call, you go know now. She's just... Eh, he almost here, he's almost, almost here. Oh, Chris. Uh, I'm heading home, but his car broke down and he's been calling the mechanic. He's, I don't even know what's going on anymore. I'm just tired. Amanda, just do as I say. Hmm? Do you have any other thing in that car? No, why? There's no time to ask questions. As I'm moving now, follow me. As I move now, hmm. just follow me. Let's go. Uh, ah, madam! Huh? Uh, just calm down now. He, he, he's coming. He's on his way now. He will, he will be here very soon. No, no, don't, don't worry. I, I'll, I'll take it from here. Eh? You will take who? What do you mean I'll take who? I can't take my own girlfriend from here. <sighs> huh? But he's coming now. Now just calm I down. I said I will take it from here. Let's go. Hey, well, you never pay me now. Half now. How much is your money? How much? Huh? Hey, give me three thousand. Three thousand. Let's go. 
There's no problem. Don't pass. Don't pass. I'm out for this guy. I lost you. See that place I saw you? Mm -hmm. That is the damn fucking numbers. If I had not come there early, ha, huh. I don't know what would have happened to you. But, but he, his car broke down. And, 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 and you, 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 no wonder he was, he, he was acting like he was calling the mechanic. He said he was calling the mechanic and he was coming and... You see you, you see? He was giving them the exact location of where you guys are. Though that picture up like this. <laughs> thank you, thank you so much, Chris. Thank huh? you. Thank you so you much. You have to be very careful. Yes, I have to. I have to. You know what? I am going to work now. Mm -hmm. When he drops me, I'll let him take you home. No, 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 I'm not. If you won't take me home, I'm not going, no. Ah, so you are going to stay with me at work? Yeah, yes, I don't mind. I don't mind, please. You don't mind? No, I don't. You stay with me at work? Yes. I'm really scared right now, please. It's fine. I don't understand you, Christopher. Are you are you for real? You mean that this guy will crash for this house? Uh, what's in the worry you? Huh? Louis, why are you being so insensitive? You know why I see this girl today? If you say I don't meet that girl today for where I see her. If only what's that girl for news today? Stop being insensitive. Oh, okay, you decided to bring her here. Eh? Why didn't you go from there? I did not decide to bring her. Oh, so you only can leave my walk and carry her house. Uh, but you walked her to the house. Why didn't you walk her to, to wherever she, she, she was supposed to, to have gone to? She could go tomorrow now. It will be your problem. It's just tonight. Tomorrow morning, she's gone. Tomorrow morning, you carry her. Come here. Eh? On your mercy, why? Good Samaritan. Can I say you get plans, Abby? Which stupid plans be that? Which, which, which stupid nonsense plans did they uh, talk Did they carry fish and, and rats put for the same place? No. Did they, did they put fish for inside water? Listen, if that girl is sleeping here tonight, eh, you will sleep on the couch. Why? And, and we'll lock this door from inside. And where will you sleep? I'll sleep in my room now. Did they crazy? You go sleep for your room when they close to my room and I will sleep here. You will lock this door. Blessing that you get planned this night. Blessing that you get planned this night. If I sleep here, you will sleep here. Nobody sleeps here tonight, the madman. You will not sleep in that room. In the grace. Ha. Come, make sure you know here. If you behave yourself. I know they behave anything more because nothing go happen here this night. I don't know where you I brought that your office. I know they sleep this place. I will not sleep, Pam. I will not. Uh, you will not sleep. In fact, Mami will lock you from this place now. Don't open, open, open this door now. I will lock you. You wouldn't lock anything. He doesn't like me much, does he? He has his reasons not to. I really don't want to be the reason you would have for a lot of your friend. Don't worry about him. I can handle it. But it's yours, I'll take the couch. Make yourself comfortable. Oh. Thank you. Thank you. Have you seen Chris? I've been... Oh. Hey. Uh, you're leaving? Yes, I am. I was in the kitchen making breakfast for you. Oh, you don't need to worry yourself about that. But you have to eat something. Yeah, I will. I will get him to when I get to the office. I just need to head home, change my outfit and go to work. Oh. Wasting of food is highly prohibited in this present economy. Um, look, it's fine if you promise you're going to get something to eat when you get to the office. Look, that's okay. Sure, I promise. Alright, um, let me see you.
Honestly, guy, I totally, completely disapprove of whatever feeling you have growing for that pompous girl. Do you understand? What feelings? I have no idea what you're talking about. Sure. Mm hmm Yeah. What? Keep telling yourself that. But I know what I'm saying. Please. What do you mean? What impetus? Nonsense. I'm so, so sorry. Here comes a majesty. Uh, stop it. I'm so sorry, girls. I totally ruined my outfit, so I had to make do with this. So, how do I look? Hot. As always. Well, you look good. Thank you, babes. Yes. I want to remind you that I have a boyfriend who needs to keep his vulture devouring eyes on me. Oh. So keep at least two meters away. Oh. You know the rules. Oh, wow. And when did Mandy become a mass snatcher? Girl. Well, I'm just saying. Some people jealous me. Some people. <laughs> hey, um, speaking of your boyfriend, did he invite Chris? Well, I don't know. Maybe he didn't, maybe not, but I doubt Chris will be there. You know, that guy doesn't like to go out and have fun. But then again, why are you asking? Why are you interested in knowing if he's coming home? Just because? Just because your certain interest in him is strange. Meanwhile, I heard you slept at the apartment the other day. Of course you had so, and you don't need to know all about the details of what went down that night, okay? Mm -hmm. So girls, what can we leave? leave? Can yes, we leave? Yes, because <gasps> if my mom gets home, our plans for today is totally cancelled. Oh. <laughs> Let's not go there right now. We must. I, I said things I shouldn't have said to you. You didn't deserve it. Please, Chris. Why are you so hell-bent on making this apology no matter how many times I have tried to avoid it? Because I need to say it and you need to hear it. Please, I am so sorry. Okay. You're forgiven. Long forgiven. Long? I don't hold any grudges against you. Thank you. Um, what about your car? Any luck finding it? It's been three months now and still nothing. I don't think I'll ever find that car. And even if I do, it, it will not be in one piece. So, will they make you pay for it then? I mean the Uber company? I don't have to pay for something I own. That's great.
Mommy. Mommy. I'm going out. Do I ever get to know where you're going these days? Uh, Mom, I'm hanging out with the girls. Again? You have formed this as a habit. I mean, this past few weeks, you're always going out. And I'm wondering if there's anything I should know. Something like? Something like. Anything, anything like. Something, something. I mean, you can talk with your mom, daughter, mom, you know, anything. Mommy, there is nothing to share, okay? I wouldn't hide anything from you. Are you sure? Of course, mommy. I have to go now. I love you. My pretty mama. My beautiful, beautiful mama. <laughs> I don't want you to go. I want you in my arms. I would love that. Do you think your mother will have a problem with it? No. I don't think she will. <laughs> she thinks highly of you. Yeah, I know. But it seems kind of weird. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe another time. I had a great day today. Me too. <sighs> I have to go now. <laughs> I know. <laughs> it's just that I'll, I'll miss you so much. I'll miss you too. <laughs> I'll see you soon. Sure. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Bye. Ah. <laughs> had fun? Mm -hmm. I had an awesome, great and a nice day. Hmm. Awesome, great and nice day. That's nice. So no dinner? Huh? Oh, the amount of food I ate today, I don't have the facilities for that, Mom. Oops. Yeah, yeah. If you say so. Just forget it's my <sighs> One minute, young lady. I'm not done. So, who is he? Who is who? Amanda, I'm talking about the young man that takes you away from this home. Don't think I'm stupid. You may have been away from the home for seven years, but that doesn't mean I do not know my daughter. Now tell me, who is he? Your imaginations are running wild, Mom. I have to go to my room now. Mm -hmm. Really? Yes, Mommy. Yes. I don't know what you're talking about. So, <laughs> you are. <laughs> I'm <have> not. <laughs> <laughs> Can you stop that? <laughs> Just stop it. I didn't do anything. I swear. <laughs> <laughs> you just girl, eh? You're something else. <laughs> hey. Hi. He has a back already? Yeah. Hi. He hates me. Who? Louis? No, he does not. Trust me, it has nothing to do with you. Then why the attitude? <coughs> Look. He's just looking out for me. He's scared you're going to treat me like I need today. That's all. 
Well, I don't blame him. But I want you to know that I will never do that to you. You are way too important to me, Christopher. And I love you. And I love you too. You do? Yes. You, <laughs> <laughs> you are crazy. No, I'm not. Yes, crazy. you are. No, Cheers. 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 <laughs> Um, I know I promised not to meddle, but you should give her some credit. She's not going to hurt him. She will. She has done it before. I know she's going to do it again. It's different this time. She's in love with him. That's what hurts the most. He's in love with her too. He tried so hard and felt miserable at it. He's been through this time and again. The last one even almost got him killed. They found each other. And they're perfect together. You don't get it. I get it. No, you don't. Listen, babes. We do not have rich parents to come looking for us. Or maybe send us on a vacation to recuperate from bad breakups. You don't know how bad it is growing up in an orphanage. So, <clears throat> Why do I get this vibe? It's more about me than it is about her. <sighs> That's what I said. That's exactly what you said. No. Is that what you think of me? A fool? You think I fall for just anybody? Babes. No, don't you dare sit on your high horse and pass judgment like you deserve to rot in jail. Who doesn't know what I meant? You think being rich is all that matters? Try wearing the shoe and see how it fits. Yes, babe, I, I, I didn't mean that way now. So, okay, I'm sorry for everything. Can you just come? Yes, so, babe. Babe, babes. You want me to do what? I want you to come with me to the orphanage. I want to introduce you to Mrs. Boris. I have told her so much about you and I'm sure she can't wait to have you. Look, you don't have to go if you don't want to. I can always give them an excuse. No, no, it's not that. It's just... You said you don't bring your affairs home. Amanda, I know what I said. This is not an affair. I am genuinely inviting my girlfriend to come see where I grew up and the people that helped raise me. Oh. I don't even know what to say, honestly. <laughs> you look freaked out. Of course I am. This is a huge step. Yes, it is. Take the step with me, will you? You have to tell him the truth. You can't hide it forever. He has a right to know. It's okay if you want to end it. But please, tell him and don't let him find out in a terrible way. What am I going to do, Chris? I am so scared to let you know that part of my past, yet I don't want to lose you to my lies. God, help me. How do I go about this? Oh my god, it's been like ages. This. Uh, uh, 
How, how? Come on, babe. Don't tell me you haven't missed me. Uh, yeah, yeah. Come on, come Whoa! Babe, I've missed you so much. Come on. I can see you both have been seeing each other. Well, I won't deny the knowledge of not knowing that my daughter has a boyfriend. But, Fiance, Chimamanda. Not quite, Mom. He proposed two weeks before I came back. But I'm not seeing any ring on your finger. Actually, I... Yeah, she needed some time to think it over. To make sure she wasn't rushing into it too soon. Mm -hmm. Though I told her to always follow her heart. I see. I see both of you have been in this relationship for long to know what you're doing. Yes, ma. Mm. I mean, mom, if that's okay with you. Of course. Why not? It's okay. You see, uh, Amanda and I love each other very much. Should I tell you something? She's the best thing that has ever happened to me. Meeting her that day, two years ago, was like a dream come true. And nothing would give me more joy than having your blessings in this critical time of our age. <sighs> two years, wow. <laughs> well, as long as you love my daughter, as long as you take good care of my daughter. Why not? Wow. Why will I not give you my blessings? Why not? Wow. Wow. Thank you very much, Ma. I mean, Mom. <laughs> Thank you very much. You don't know how happy this decision has made me. Babe, we'll be getting married soon. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you. That wasn't so hard. You know, I was expecting a bit of hostility from her. But she's so cool. Yeah, she she's quite nice and accommodating. But you took me by surprise. I mean, didn't you tell me you'll be back in some months' time? What changed your mind? You changed my mind. I've missed you so much. And you don't expect me to be walking, 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 walking when I know you're far away from me. Yeah. Ha! Ah, I think I... I have to go and see my folks. Yeah, you should. I mean, your mom will be so mad that you opted to come in here first before going home. I can do it. Well, I'm happy seeing you now. Oh, yeah. Just let me see you off. I just feel like it's sending the whole day with you. <laughs> That's my girl! What is wrong with that boy? Eh? And why is his line not going through? His phone is not connecting. Why would he do this to us? Leaving the airport to God knows where. Eh? Why? Is this how he's supposed to treat his parents? We are wanting so much, Philomena. It will be home. It's not as if he's a little baby that he can't find his way home. Relax. Chief Desmond is my baby. And this is not a question of coming back home or not. Huh? Is he supposed to treat his parents that way? Calm down. Calm down. At the rate we are going, you will even break down before he even gets back home. Yes! He's here at last. I missed you. I missed you. I missed you. I missed you. I missed 
Hey, you have to say smart, my boy. <laughs> <laughs> How is everything? Fine. Oh, you are looking sharp. Yes. Come, come on, come on. I missed you. Come on. This is strange. This is wonderful. Easy, take it easy, take it easy, take it easy. Take it easy. Yeah. When did you do that? That's wonderful. Yeah. She landed at the airport and went off. The driver said he waited and waited. You didn't show up. Eh? Oh, mom, stop worrying about Where it. would be so important to you than seeing us first? At <laughs> least, mom, I'm here now. <laughs> Dad, Philomena is here. He's back, honey. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Thanks, mom. I'm more free. I'm very hungry. I need to test the value of the leaders. You and food. I have you covered. Yeah, That's right. Go there. <laughs> Eat as much as oh, you can. Like <laughs> Wow. How many characters away? I mean, is it that heavy that you cannot put it on? Listen, is it that you wear it? Or you call him and give him back his ring. Amanda, to tell you the gospel truth, I'm even mad at you for keeping this as a secret for two good years. Come on! Mom, it's not like that. Now tell me, how is it like? Because I'm not getting anything. I didn't tell you about this one because I wasn't sure he's the one for me and I'm still not sure if I want him. Does this new guy know about Desmond? So mom, dad, mm -hmm. that's how it is. That's just how it is. Wait, let me get this. You are not home yet, and you want us to officially meet her. I wonder. How? Oh, Mom, you know Amanda very well, right? Both of you do talk on the phone. On the phone, you said, Desmond. Those two are different. Exactly. Yes, I may have FaceTimed with her a few times, but marriage... No, no, son is too sudden. Talk too sudden, please. Mom, I love Amanda so much. As a matter of fact, she's one of the best things in my life right now. A minute, son. Hmm. Wait a minute. Is there something that is going on that we are supposed to know? I don't know. Let me ask you. Is this girl running away anytime soon? Oh, I have suit us so many that we are afraid she might choose someone else. What are you? Listen. I ask you this question because I do not see the need for this search. Yes. Honestly. Please. Dad, it's because I love Amanda so much. And I've stayed far away from her for too long than I can bear. This month, my son. Mm. Love. Why can't you think about it? Just give yourself a little time to think through it. I mean, your love for each other may seem inseparable, but we are trying to let you know that marriage is not something you can just rush. Exactly. Like exactly. Oh, Mom, I, I just want to be with Amanda. Hmm. What's so difficult about it? I want her as my wife. Hmm. As a matter of fact, I want to start the marriage process. Yeah, wow. Wow. What is difficult? Yeah. I want to meet her people. No one that. Tell me, tell me, is anything the matter? Nothing is wrong about your decision, but what we are trying to let you know is that marriage, you have to think about it very well I, before entering. I know. I, I know what I'm doing. It's a difficult institution. Well, there's no problem if you if you know what you are doing. No it's problem. Okay. Once you know what I you're just doing. want to get married to the love of my you life. Will. Um 
N not really, but I'll be fine. When you get back, we'll talk about it. When are you finishing? Chris, don't worry about me, okay? Just get done with your exams. Love you too. You missed me? For you. Thank you. But what are you doing here? Can't I come and visit my girl anymore? You've been held up with work and I couldn't come and pick you at the office because you are so against it. Won't you let me in? Oh, oh of course. Um, it's actually a good thing you're here because I have something important I would like us to talk about. Can that wait after lunch? I want to take you out on a date. And please don't say no. Ever since I came back, we've not been out. And I want to have a time alone with you. Um, yeah. Lunch we do. Just come in, me. Get dressed. Okay. Okay. Just have a seat. Mm -hmm. Get dressed. All right. Uh, oh, sorry about this. Just have a seat. I will be waiting. I'm sure. I had a great day with you today. Yeah, me too. Oh. It's really look good on you. Honestly, I can't wait to have you all to myself. Yes, man. You know how I keep it. Yeah. No sex till our wedding night. No sex. I'll miss you. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna miss you. It's not like you're going for um, or I'm going for so. Okay. I know, but I just want to be with you every moment. I have to go in now. Miss you. Yeah, it's okay. Wait, I'm gonna 
messieurs Chris, Chris, Chris. You sounded off and worried. That's why I came to see you. You're having the best time of your life. No, no, no. It's don't, not... don't, don't touch me. Chris, you told me you had exams. Yes, I did. So explain, I can explain. Just stop, stop it. Chris! 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 Just leave my house. Please. Can we at least talk about this? Talk about what? Talk about what, Mandy? For months now, you have been confessing your undying love for me, yet you're engaged to another man. I'm not engaged to him. He proposed, but I didn't give him an answer. How can you be this wicked? Leading two men on at the same time. Is this a joke to you or something? No. You are not a joke to me. I didn't tell you because I knew I was going to end things with him once he comes back. And I didn't give him an answer because I wasn't sure of what I wanted then. So my coming to Nigeria was for me to figure things out. And luckily for you, you found your next rebound. No. Me? No. no. Using me to process whatever that you're processing. Chris, you Don't touch me. Don't you dare touch me. Chris, please. Chris, please. Leave my house. Mandy, get out of my house. I don't want to do something stupid. Chris, I love you. Really? You love me? Yes. Chris! Chris! Chris, please! Chris! I know I made some mistakes in the past And my past is here haunting me What is it again now? Hey? Don't you ever get tired? I won't go until I see him. He's not here. He hasn't come back since that day he left. I know you're not saying the truth. I get it. I hurt him big time, but can you at least give me the chance to explain myself? He's had enough of it, okay? So no matter how you try to twist it, it will not change the fact that you cheated. And you know it, you messed up, you I messed up big time. Listen, I don't want to judge you, okay? Just go. I, I know, I get that. I messed up, what I did is unacceptable, it's unforgiving. But if there is one thing I know for sure is that what I feel for Chris is real. And I haven't felt this way for anyone in a long time. Mm. I am not the one you should be telling this story. But he has refused to talk to me. He, he doesn't want to give me listening ear. Please. You're his friend. Can you talk to him, please? I beg you. Please. Uh, okay. I'll talk to him. Alright. Thank you. No, don't count on it. I'll talk to him, but you have to stop coming here. Allow him to come to you when he's ready. Be cool. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. I'll, I'll talk to you. Bye-bye. You promise? I'll change my mind. No, please. Bye-bye.
Sousa. Fine, Mom. And I'm not hungry. Come on, Chima Amanda. This has been your answer for the past few days now. What is it? Hey! You're beginning to scare me. Just wants to be left alone. <sighs> Alright, just get up and eat little. Mommy, I want to be left alone. Listen, I will feed you myself. You are going. Mommy, I want to be left alone. All right, all right. All right, let's go. Something is wrong with you. Is our number not going to? Sam? Food is ready. Let's go and eat. Mom, her number is not going to. Are you sure she's okay? Hi again. <sighs> this month. I am sure she is busy with something. That's why she's not picking up your calls or call back. Mom, it's been days. It's been days, Mom. You have to give her some break, okay? You don't have to hover around her like a vulture. She's got her own life to live. Please, just give her some time until you marry her, okay? Mom, it's been days I haven't heard from her. I'm just worried. This one, she's not running away, is she? Come on. Come, let's go and eat. Come. Hmm? I do that. Now we come. We've worried about it. I don't know why I haven't done it. Just Stop worrying yourself. You don't have to worry. I should have listened to you. I should have told him the truth when I had the chance to. But I thought Desmond wasn't coming back until the end of the year. And look where it got me. I've lost Chris. You haven't lost him. Not yet. I have. He wouldn't talk to me. He would not reply my messages. He hates me. He doesn't hate you. He's just hot. Hot that you didn't tell him the truth. Listen. I think you should just give him some time to process this. You don't get it, do you? Get what? He will never talk to me again. He thinks I used him, but I did not. Amanda, are you okay? This is exactly what I was afraid of. She haunting you like this. 
that's why I was indifferent towards her. But that doesn't mean she should be blamed completely. So I'm the one to blame, right? Tell me, I am the one to be blamed. Was I the one who lied and let her on knowing that there's someone else waiting on the other side? Or maybe you're right. I was the one that fell stupidly in love with her. No, you're not stupid. You're in love. That's why you need to hear from her before leaving. You need to hear outside of the story. There's nothing to hear. There's nothing to hear. Listen to. I got the message. And I'm not running away. I just want to go somewhere quiet and have a long time. So that when I get back, she'll be way out of my mind and heart. Mm. Only if true love was that easy to come by. You said it yourself. Yo, it was very difficult for you to get over that girl from years back. You were too sure no one was going to take over her place in your life. Amanda came and everything changed. That love has got to mean something, right? Some mistakes in the past, and my past is still haunting me. I'm not gonna run away. It's time to fix uh, all the things Hi. I got wrong in I, the past. Um, can I see her? I promise I, I, I won't take time. You know, we really need to talk. Sure. Thank goodness you're here at least. Anne can concentrate at work and not come here. How is she? What do you think? Excuse me. It's time to fix all the things I got wrong in the past. It's time to mend the broken bond. Time to reveal the secrets I kept. Cause I'm not gonna run away. It's time to write all the things I got wrong in the past. It's time to mend a broken bond Time to reveal the secrets that I kept Cause I'm not gonna run away But I'm going to write all the things I got wrong in the past I am not leaving you. Just try and get some sleep. I'll be here when you wake up. You're here. Yes, I am here. I'm sorry, Sam. I'm sorry. I, 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 I didn't know. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Sam.
eyes. Hey. You're here. Yes. I, I thought it was a dream. And why would you think that? Each day I wake up with the thoughts of you. So real I could feel your touch. But nothing happens. Nothing ever changes. I'm not even sure anything would happen just because you're here. Well, I don't know if anything is going to happen. But I'm sure of one thing. I hate seeing you sick. So why are you here? To say your final goodbye? No. Why would you think that? I am here to make sure you get well. You need to get some rest. Chris? Shh, 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 shh. We'll talk about it. Not right now. You need to rest, okay? You're here, Chris.
everything I have known, all the truth I have believed were all lies. You never planned any of this. You didn't want it, this. You're damn right. I never wanted any of this. She's my mother, and Amanda is my sister. A sister that I'm in love and slept with. How fucked up is that? You have to calm down, man. I'm trying, but I can't. I can't. You know, I think, I think God is out for some sick joke. How do I deal with this? How do I deal knowing this truth? Is, is that even possible? Listen, please. You don't have to do anything stupid, okay? I promise we are going to get to the root of this. To get to the root of this together. 24 hours. That was all I needed to find some hope in life. In the next minute, everything is completely shattered. See, I'm still trying to figure all this out. I know you're angry. Your heart. And in pain. I understand. I felt exactly this way when I lost you. I mean, I could barely eat. It's a DNA test. This is unbelievable. No wonder you were so drawn to him. Yeah. Indeed, blood is thicker than water. So, what do you intend to do now? As it is, I'm totally confused. Oh, I can't tell you the truth. I am. See, he loves her. Honestly, he loves her. To the extent he's refusing to admit the truth. Really? Oh. I just hope. I hope, I hope they have not. Uh, uh, I hope so too. Oh gosh. Oh babes, this is really oh. good. But 
whatever may be the case, you have to be stronger. No, 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 babes, you need to pull yourself together. There's no room for any more crying. We need to prefer solution right now. <sighs> God, 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 God. You see, we need to act fast. Otherwise, Amanda's life will be ruined forever. So what do you suggest I do? Ah, babes, I really need some time to think. I really need to think. You can't do this, mom. You just can't invite them over. My dear, there's no other way out than this. It's for our own good. I know. But I'm not ready. Not now that everything is just happening at the same time. You and Chris are siblings. The mistake has been made already. Yes. That's it. But both of you can be together. Please. Amanda. What do you think? People will say when they hear this. Can you face the drama? I can't even hardly put myself together. Are you sure you can face it? Do you know what you're asking me to do, Mom? Of course. I'm asking you to choose Desmond. Yes, that's the only way out of this dilemma. Please. Amanda. Amanda, come, I think they are here. Come, my darling. Wow. You look amazingly beautiful. Come. Relax. I wish your brother is here right now. But I understand. He needs time to process all this. Now, listen to me. Do not forget what we discussed. We are your beautiful smile. Okay? Ferris and all this will pass away. Please. Now get the door. Yes. Wow! Interesting. You are so beautiful. Mm. Look at that. You are even finer here than when we spoke on phone. Thank you, ma. Thank you, sir. My dear, you are very beautiful. Yes. Amazingly beautiful. Mm. No wonder my son couldn't uh, wait for one more day to have you in his arms. Mm. Uh, so I'm sure you must have had, had a very hard time in keeping men off our shadows. So beautiful. You're beautiful, my dear. Thank you, sir. You did yes. well. Yeah. Ah. Yeah. Let's go here. Yeah. Hey, it's wonderful. <laughs> Very pretty. I think I like her. Why are you? Yes.
baby, my baby. You never cease to amaze me with your amazing cooking skills. You're just feeding me in different ways. <laughs> Clement. I wish I can marry you right away. You don't have to say things like that. Why? Because... I love you and would want to marry you. Do you think I am whiling away with you while I am at work here? No, it's not like that. Just that you keep talking about it. Yes, it is not bad to have a good life, okay? But we can't be talking about marriage. I am still young and I'm still in school. Who said that will serve as a hindrance to our love? I love you because I love you. I don't mind if you're still in secondary school or not. And if I decide on this, you will have no choice than to deal with it. Are you serious? I'm damn serious. Um, okay, now you have to eat your food eh? When you're done eating, we'll talk about it. Onyeka. Mm? Why do you keep brushing this topic off whenever I bring it up? I am not brushing it off. I just said we should eat. When you're done eating, we'll talk about it. Okay? Oh, she has to work at you. Please, you need to eat. Have this one. Eat some. Oh. All this. All, all this. Ah, so stupid. to leave my daughter alone. And you're still hovering around her like a hog. Huh? Uh, Mama, I... Uh, but, Mama, he's leaving now. Why are you shouting? Will you shut up your mouth? Huh? How many times would I tell you to leave this boy alone? Huh? And to stop mingling with him. Have I... Have I... Have I told you about that? But, Mama, I love him. Chinky. Will you shut up your mouth? You love him. What do you know about love? What do you know about love? Uh, eh? You haven't even finished school and you are following me up and down. You are talking of love. Uh, but look, Oji, please, leave my daughter alone. I don't want to repeat myself. Do you hear me? Juliet. Mama, leave me alone. Do you want to go You love him. Let me let me love. Go outside. Love, love, one tente. Are you still here? Out! What says? You, you love him. Let me get inside the house now. Love. Love, 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 you said it was urgent. Is everything okay? No. It's my mother. I don't know what's wrong or what's going on over there. I need to head home. Oh, I don't understand. She suffered a stroke last night. Since then, no one is saying anything reasonable about it. I need to go home and see her. Oh, so, you mean you want to leave me here all alone? Of course not. You are not all alone. I will always have you in my heart, just as you will have me in yours. <laughs> Our lives are intertwined. When 
Nyeka. We are meant for each other. Okay. Clement, promise me you will come back, right? Just promise me you'll be back. Of course. I'll be back. Just want to go and see her and know how she's faring myself. After then, I'll come back. You know I can't live without you. I love you. I love you too. Just promise me you'll be back, right? Promise me. I will. I'll be back. You promise? Please be back. <laughs> but you never came. No calls from you. Not even messages. No, I didn't get any from you. I was the one who came looking for you and you were nowhere to be found. I even came to your workplace, and no one gave me anything concrete. Onika was going to come. I was going to come to honor my promise to you. But then, my mother passed on. I must not kind of shattered my life. I wanted you to be there on that day, at least to reassure me that life is worth living again. You see, I am sorry I didn't come back. But my father did. I told him about you. I begged him to come and look for you. He did. He came, but then you had left. I left? Yes. To where? I don't know. That was what he told me. He said your mother told him that we are nowhere to be found. Because I was pregnant. My mom couldn't handle the shame. She sent me far away to her sister's place in another community. You were pregnant? You should have known. Your father found me. Ah. That's right. Your father traced me to my auntie's place. Then he told me. Oyeka. Oyeka. Good afternoon, sir. Please, who are you? Do you know Clement Abbasi? Yes, I know, I know Clement. I am his father. What? Don't be surprised. Your mother told me. She did? She was very angry. And I understand her. No mother would be happy to see her daughter get it pregnant at this stage. She complained bitterly that you should be sitting for your wife this year. Yes, but I have to wait till I put to bed. You are really sacrificing so much. Um, sir, what about Clement? Is he coming here? That is why I have come to see you. He will not be coming anymore, Oyenka. Not ever to this place. But why? He, he promised to come back. He, yes, he promised to come back to me. Forget about the promises he made to you. Men can promise girls heaven and earth while in bed. Believe me, he will not be coming back again. No, you are lying. I, I, I know my Clement. He will never do such thing. Listen to me, young girl. Do you think I came all the way down here to tell you lies about all these things? Do you know why I sought you out? Because he's my son. I know that he usually have one or two concubines whenever he goes out for work, despite him having a beautiful wife at home. And I'm in this village because I don't want whomever he has promised to fall victim. 
having to wait for him when I know he's not going to come back. So Clement is married? Clement is married and he's not coming back? Hey! He is. To my friend's daughter. Hey, Chimo! Clement is married and he's <laughs> Chimo! <laughs> He told me that he was here to take care of me till I put to bed. He even assured me that he was going to take me back to you. He told me nothing. Nothing at all. He didn't even bother to tell me that he found you at last. As for the parts, Onika, I was so devastated that I have to marry Philomena as a deep plan. Why would my father do something like this? Why? Which means you had no idea that I had twins for you. Mm. Your father took me to the city hospital. Took good care of me till I gave birth to my twins. Of course, I thought he did all that because he cared. Later did I know that he had another mission. Hmm. Your father took my son away from me. He took Ebukai away from me. I got away with Chimamanda. He would have taken Chimamanda away from me too. Yeah. Shut up! What of you should just shut up! Shut up! Stop talking! Clement! Are you trying to say she had your babies? Oh! She was the one your father promised me he would take care of. Ah! ah. Philomena! What do you know? What did my father tell you about? What do you know about Onika here? He told me you had your head twisted and that he was going to take care of it. Then one day he called me over and handed me a baby boy. Then I just lost a pregnancy. I was going through a whole lot of stress. He brought that child and told me to take care of him. He said I should raise him as mine. And it was like that child completed my whole life. Yes. Wait a minute, uh, Philomena. But you told me you found that child in the garbage. That Didn't you? That was your father's idea. Ah. I was even afraid to divulge the details. Because I was scared I was going to lose my baby boy hmm. this month. This month here is my son. I don't care who gave birth to him or not. I raised him. I took care of him as mine. Wait a minute. Hmm. He is my son. And nobody is going to take him away wait, from me. Just wait, hold, hold on. Desmond. Yes. Hold on. You mean Desmond was the child he handed to you? Yes. Mm. Desmond here is my son. Wait, wait, wait. Everyone should just hold on. If I was the child that was handed over, I think there's a mistake somewhere. This doesn't make any sense. Yes, there is. There is a mistake somewhere because. Mother, you told me Chris is my twin brother. You were so sure, Mom. Chris. Chris. That's not... No. My head. No, no. Your brother has the same mark. You have. He has the same bed mark. What you have. Yes. Talking about bed mark. This one here also has a bed mark. It is should have blade.
Freunde. Are you in the bathroom? Amanda. Amanda. Mom, by the time you are reading this, I must be far gone. Do not take it the hard way. I am not abandoning you. But at this point, I need to stay away, far away on my own, to think and process all that has happened. My life at this point is shattered and my world spiraling before me. I do not blame you nor hold any grudge against you. But I need space to get my sanity back. I love you, Mom, and I will miss you dearly. Goodbye for now. She doesn't have any, but she is insisting on seeing you. Okay, send her. Alright, sir. Hi, Chris. You just disappeared, like you never existed. I searched, I looked, but nothing. I had no choice. I needed to leave. A lot happened. I couldn't grasp on. I was losing my mind. Amanda, you had a choice. You had me. So, um... How have you been? Oh, I'm good. You're not looking bad yourself. And 
really seem like a very good woman. Yeah. She really is a good woman. I I didn't know that she... You married a great woman and she's even expecting. That's fantastic, Chris. And now... Uh, I'm also sorry about Desmond. What happened with him wasn't fair. This is no longer in pain. Yeah. And I believe he's in a better place now. Mm. The truth is, I am here to tell you something important. Her name is Krista, and she's turning three this December. Wow. Three. Wait. Is she? Yes. Why didn't you tell me? I... I didn't find out until I left. You could have called me when you found out that you were pregnant. I'm sorry, Chris. I, th I didn't know what to do. I was confused. I... That is why I am here. To tell you about her. You need to know. And she deserves to meet her father. Does she know about me? Of course she does. I never lied to her about you. Look, I am not here for you to take up any responsibility of any kind. I just want her to meet you. Uh, that's if you want her in your life. Look, wait, wait, hold it right there. What kind of a man do you think I am? Of course I want to know my daughter. I want to be in her life. That's great. I really don't want this to be a problem in your family. Your wife. No. Don't worry about her. I can handle it. Well then, her birthday is December 3rd and I know she'll be happy to meet you. I won't miss it for anything. Thank you. I'll send you the address when the time comes. No. Thank you. You did so much. Thank you for letting me know about her. You're welcome. I should get going now. Wrong in the past. 
It's time to mend. 